made out of a few different materials. Um, it's pretty sweet. You can definitely, uh, yeah, hold your pencils or whatever else, you know. So this is the locking mechanism here. You can see there's a lot of space. Standard Canadiana pencil. Focus isn't great on this GoPro here. But yeah, this I got from Japan. Pretty cool. Yeah, it's uh, he's. This is made out of a uh, Saint or no, yeah, Saint Smart Red transparent TPU. It's labeled as just red, but it's it's got some transparency to it. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. Just because I uh, didn't have pink and this it's got the squishiness to it like a uh, eraser wood this is made out of uh, Rapunzel silver filamentum it's really nice uh, filament not not too too cheap though I'm not thinking this doing a good job of focusing it on. Okay. And this is a uh, Hatchbox Yellow. And this one is, um, I think it was, yeah, a Maze 3D wood filament. Printed very well. This is using the stock um, wood fill settings on the, the preset for the Prusa. This is the uh, uh, Vertical Galaxy Filamentum Black and then it's got like gold specks. So I've been using, I don't know if you guys have seen it, but Chris Warwick's uh, Pretty PLA. So that's all of, well actually yeah for this Pretty PLA and then Pretty PLA and then his TPU profile has been awesome like that one for even for like um, quad parts that's all I've used is the Chris Warwick's uh, profile and it's never given me any issues the, the supports come off super easy um, there's a seam also in here I don't know if you can see it but uh, it's not a big deal if the rest of it comes out like this like it's really really nice I've compared it to their new presets for the slicer on the Prusa and it's also really good but um, I still prefer this uh, preset here um, so yeah that's pretty much what I've used and just locks into place here it's a little bit loose but it's not going to be handled too much but yeah there we go and it's super glued together it comes in uh, one two three four five pieces so you can print it separately uh, the STLs also have the ability to print these two together so you can change color half or yeah whatever it takes there to up there and then you can also, there's like the STL for these two pieces together too, that you can change it. But I, this is at an angle, so I haven't looked if the STL is like straight or at an angle also, but it's an option and there's an option for it to be one piece all together. So you've got a few options there for printing this. It's, it's an awesome print, it's very nice. And um, to get an idea, you can see the build plate here. Uh, let me see, I always forget the size here. So 250 milli millimeters there. And my uh, cool old sign there. So yeah, uh, guys think I'm printing this? Yeah, let me know. And I'll leave the description, in the description, the, the link to this print. Hope you guys enjoyed.